Next, we will be moving on to the Conservation Commission. So I don't think we have anyone here from that. Do we have a page on that? On 47. Okay, let's have trouble looking. Do we want to look at that? $300 change. About $300. I didn't even look at that. <coughs> Does anyone want to comment on it? Uh, let me look at it for a second, Mr. Chairman, please. I have no comment. Mr. Moore? No. Mr. Bean? Negative, sir. Okay. I'm outside. Thank you. Um, next, we will be the assessing office. <coughs> Mr. Tinker. Good evening. I do have some, some documents to pass out if I could. Thank you. Um, as you will see by, you want me to wait for Mike to get back? I think most of this you've covered in. You can start. Go ahead and yeah. start. I, yeah. I, um, think, I think, I don't think he'll get upset. Yeah. Um, so overall on the budget, um, we added a new line item. Other than that, we went, our budget actually went down around close to 20% based on the elimination of uh, uh, one of our data collector positions. Um, the line item regarding contracted services is the addition to the budget. Um, it represents a $60,000 uh, budget on it. Uh, and that has to do with actually the 40000 we saved within our budget. Um, we're putting that forty into that line item as well as 20000 being um, reduced from the legal budget and put into the assessing budget for those services. Um, the documents I gave you, um, the first one you've seen, um, the second page, actually the first document relates to uh, the p potential appeals that we discussed at an earlier date. Um, page number two is a spreadsheet of the actual appeals that we've received. That is the full list. Um, so it just goes along pretty much with what we anticipated. Um, and then the final document is actually, for your references and, and your records, is the final abatement list with interest page and uh, abate uh, the appeals highlighted so you see the value differences because the second sheet, we still don't have taxpayer opinions of value, and yet we haven't received the final documents on those appeals. So the third, uh, the abatement sheets kind of give you an idea, and they go along with page one of what the potential exposure is. Kind of to support the line item for the contracted services um, to help us um, defend those cases. If you have any Questions, Mr. Pierce. Um, I really don't think I can't see anything. Thank you, Mr. Moore. Great report. I like this. It's going to take me a bit, but thank you. Okay. And just so that the the voters or the people who are watching are clear, right. your budget is re is requested to be increased by just about twenty thousand. And that 20000 is funded by a transfer from the legal department, which we'll be talking about later. Right, so, so the, the session budget will be level for Just so we make it simple. Right. Thank you. That's correct, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mr. Dean. I have no questions. Mr. Uh, ben uh, made one of my points, which is a great one. It's basically a flat budget. And um, the other thing is I think it's absolutely necessary, given the um, litigation that we're facing, predominantly related to utilities and commercial properties um, that we're um, in a position to defend the town's interests. So i um, very comfortable with this. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much for coming in tonight. Okay. <coughs> Have a safe drive home. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. See you later. Thank you. Take care.